hello everyone in this video I am going to show you how to call stored procedures using adio.net basically we can have three kinds of stored procedure one is a stored procedure which does not take any input parameter and it does not return any value that is I have here say get all employees which is a simple select statement which neither takes any input parameter it does not return any output value it simply returns a table and here I have the table employee ID employee name it is going to return employee ID employee name it is going to return and another is a stored procedure which contains some input parameter but no output parameter like I have a stored procedure with me get employees by department ID so I have an input parameter DID if the input parameter is 0 I am writing simple T SQL transact SQL if the input parameter is 0 it should return all employees if the input parameter value is non-zero then it should return the employees belonging to that department right click say execute should ask for input parameter say input parameter is zero say okay I get all the 16 records if I re-execute this and now if I give input parameter as 1009 I should get only those employees whose department ID is 1009 so there are 10 records so I am passing input parameter and it is not at all returning any value so no return value it simply is give us a table and I have one more kind of stored procedure which has both the things which takes input parameters and it performs some operation and returns us some output parameter say I have a stored procedure that is nothing but get salary by employee ID where employee ID and employee salary I have two parameters in which employee ID is input parameter 